Hello and welcome to Second Drafts, everything you need to write, edit, and publish your way. Today on Second Drafts, we're going over why you should have an About the Author section in your book, and if you're going to sell your book on Amazon, why you need to make an Author Central account. So first off, the About the Author section in a book is fairly straightforward. It's a section of the book, usually at the back, where readers can learn a little bit more about you and perhaps your other works. The main reason you need an About the Author section is because that is your direct link to your audience. If you can get a personal connection with them, telling them about how you came to be a writer, it can leave an impression with them. It's your chance to show the person behind the mask and let the audience know who you are. There's a reason why so many big authors will mention where they live or if they have a spouse or kids. They want you to connect with them so that you feel closer to them and ultimately will think of them as more than just a faceless writer. Another reason is that it's a place you can use to link to other things, like a social media site, or leave a call to action, like asking them for a review of the book they just read. It's a great spot in the book that you can use to your advantage, so use it. To add on top of that, Author Central is an Amazon service where you can have a whole page dedicated to you and your works. You can put up your bio, the same or different from the one you put in your book. And once again, you can try to create a personal connection with your audience. Author Central also has a lot of features just for the author. You can view your sales info and author rank on Amazon. You can see all your reviews in one convenient place. And you can even have the ability to set up multiple author pages if you have multiple pen names. All in all, having an author central account and an about the author section in your book might seem like a minor, unnecessary thing, but they can help out a lot if you set them up correctly. So that's all that we have for today's video. If you have any questions, be sure to ask them in the comments below. Subscribe to the channel so you don't miss anything. And remember that Second Drafts has everything you need to write, edit, and publish your way. Do you want to support production of this YouTube series? Visit www.patreon.com slash and become a patron today.